SME Market Hub. Buy, sell, list, connect. Unfortunately, I did not make it to the Duty Cray concert, but I'm here starting London Fashion Week. On a very good note, I'm at the International Fashion Showcase 2015 in the Nigeria section, of course. And, you know, we have a bunch of amazing designers showcasing here tonight. Um, I'm easy go showing Orange Culture is on display as well. Gray, Kenneth Ize, as well as T.I. Nathan. And it was actually organized by Lagos Fashion Design Week and Style Hot Files. So I have with me the brains behind this entire event, Omoya Miakele of Star House Files. How are you doing tonight? I'm very well, thank you. Okay, so I want to know what inspired you to get you know, involved with this showcase this year and what was planning it like? Uh, to be honest, we've been involved since inception. The first international fashion showcase was in 2012 and that was sort of, that was the maiden edition and we, I think the exhibition at the time was themed Tales by Moonlight or something. So it's something we've been a part of since its inception. Uh, we missed it last year, but we decided this year, you know, it was important for us to come back to it because we realized that 2012 was a very great out, um, very great outing for the designers. And of course, we couldn't have done it on our own. You know, we had a, whew. <laughs> you know, we had the sponsors, we had Guarantee Trust Bank, you know, they've always, I mean, they believe in us and they were more than willing to support. And of course, Feirouz, you know, with manufacturing and all of that being in, in the pipelines with any PC. So it's, uh, it's sort of a 360 degrees collaboration, if you get what I mean. So private sector, public sector to try and achieve our goals of ensuring that, you know, Nigerian fashion can become commercial. So. And do you think this year has been like, you know, a huge success? It's been, I mean, how do you define success? For me, I mean, success tonight for us is working with the right team, you know. Everything that was done in here was done by a team of Nigerians. You know, we worked with the White Space Creative Agency, we worked with Yegua from, Yegua did the, you know, Yegua was the curator from Stranger Lagos, you know. And, you know, the team at Lagos Fashion and Design with Guadami, Oyiko, you know, everyone, it's been, people pulling in resources, so for me that's success. Having the designers here to talk about their work, that's phenomenal. I mean, it's something we haven't done in the last two or three years, so that for me is success, that we can be here. the fabulous creative director <laughs> of Orange Culture. How are you doing tonight, Bayer? I'm good, how are you? Very well, thank you. So on a scale of one to fashion, how excited are you about tonight? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I guess fashion. <laughs> I'm excited, I'm really excited. I'm just glad it's finally happening and I'm glad that it's looking good as well. So I'm excited, I'm definitely very excited. What collection are you showing here today? I'm showing my SS15 because I don't want my autumn winter to be out yet, yeah. so, <laughs> so I'm showing my last collection and then I shall debut the next one in a few weeks, so yeah. So you know, what was the inspiration behind that collection? Behind the collection, SS15 basically was just inspired by my mom, so basically we, when I was younger she used to dance around like in like her Benin attire, so basically I just wanted to do prints inspired by her, so you can see like the prints are like naked women dancing like Benin beads and stuff like that, so basically it's just inspired by the idea of that. It would explain to you when you see it how like I really don't believe that there's a line between that, I just feel like clothes should be clothes and whatever you want to wear you should wear it really. <laughs> The beautiful Fubu of um, Isigo. How are you doing, Sam? Hi, I'm good. I just asked Bayer this, don't laugh, but on a scale of one to fashion, <laughs> you already started laughing. 
<laughs> okay, on a scale of one to fashion, how excited are you about tonight? <laughs> Super excited! <laughs> It's such a weird Okay. <laughs> okay, so um, what collection are you showing tonight? I'm showing my um, spring summer 50, okay. which is called um, Taboo. And what was the inspiration behind that? Uh, it's basically inspired by the Wadabi um, tribe, which is a northern Fulani tribe found in the Sahel. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, it's good catching up with you, and we'll look out for some of your stuff. Thank you. Good seeing you. Thank you very much. Hi guys, if you just enjoyed watching that video and you want to stay up to date with the latest in entertainment, lifestyle and more from inside Africa, why don't you hit the subscribe button right now. And if you want to keep on watching videos, then just simply hit the more videos button.